Yo, what's going on you guys? Welcome back to a brand new Apex video, where today I'm going to be playing Apex Legends with mouse and keyboard. <gasps> now, this is the part in the video where all you mouse and keyboard players just like type in the comments like, oh, what the hell, man? This is this very easy, I do it every day. I'm a controller player, okay? I downloaded this game on PlayStation about two years ago and PlayStation has a controller and then I just started playing with a controller and before I knew it, I was a controller player. And now if I download a game and I play with a mouse and keyboard, it kind of fucks with my sense. If you want to play this game casually, I definitely recommend controller. However, if you want to find a place to improve your skills in this game, a controller basically has a very low ceiling, which means that very quickly you'll be basically as good as everyone else. And every like big difference kind of comes down to your natural awareness of the battle and just your like quick reaction times. Uh, when it comes to mouse and keyboard, there's a lot more variation of what you can do. Yes, you can stand around loading a death box while moving about instead of standing around like a fuck. There are stab strafing, as long as respawn allows that. There's like these weird movement mechanics where you can just like jump around like a fucking idiot and all of a sudden you're killing enemies because they don't know how to hit you. There just seems to be so much more that you can do with mouse and keyboard than with controller. And maybe that's not the case. Maybe it's just a case of the grass is greener on the other side. However, I'll only know that if I try it out myself. So after playing for two years on controller and hitting level 500 almost uh, with controller, I want to go and try out what Apex Legends like on mouse and keyboard. All right, Pathfinder it is today. Um, my good friend who I've played with a lot. <laughs> Actually, to, to be honest, I was quite good with Pathfinder, though I don't know if I should say that right now. Pathfinder is my worst legend. I've never played him. The first time I'm seeing him, the goddamn robot. We touch ground for the first time here. Let me go with a wingman because that requires my fragile precision. <laughs> I do not have any precision in this game. One of the things that I can do right now, which I can't do on console, is swap around my weapons from one place to another. I don't know what kind of benefit this has, but I see, like, console players do that all the time. Okay, boys, what shall we do? What shall we do? What shall we do? There we go! First chase, boys! Oh, wait, I got a kill there? Did I actually take them down? There's another one right there, though. That's another Pathfinder, that's for sure. Bro, I can't help you because I can't barely help myself. It's just you and me, friend. Let's not All right, Pathfinder is down, Pathfinder is down. This is such a weird way of playing Apex. Like, I need to have all my focus to just, oh shit, they took that. To just play the standard game. No, 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 I, I don't want that. I just want this. Yes, thank you. I've never felt so slow in my entire life. It's like, I know what I want to do, but I don't know how to do it. And then everyone else around me is also just like trying to figure it out. Like, I am lucky that I'm playing right now in the start of lobbies. Bro. Bro, this shit's not fire, yo. This is so strange. The fact that we get this much time is really lenient. The fact that I can heal right now and they're not pushing is really nice, but I just don't have to aim. Bro, I forgot what my aim button was. I forgot what my fire button was. God damn. Oh boy. This is uh, worse than I thought. I am so garbage. I can see what I want to do, but just like the movement to get there is not there. The aim is not there. And then you're playing a match where people are also just like not doing it. <laughs> the fact that I was able to like bat and use a med kid while they knew I was there. It's so weird. So this entire experience is like, it's strange. It is really, really strange to me. One kill, two assists last game. Let's see how this one goes. Maybe a little bit better. Maybe a little bit worse. I don't know what like, what like the lore is behind these lobbies. Like whether people actually like will land at the normal spots or whether they just 
go whatever they feel like. I don't know. That's like the, the craziest thing. It feels like I should be super familiar with this, but it's completely new in another sense. All right, I'm going to have to find a weapon real quick. Yo, that's a fuse. Bro, how dare you use fuse against me? There we go. Boom, man. Yo, what are you doing? This Ash was just like, if I sneakity snookity, they will not find me. Bro, who are you fighting? There we go. Also, the colors are weird. I changed the colors because I saw someone say like, oh man, if you change your colors on PC, you'll, you'll be playing better. So I was like, well, Fuck it, if I'm changing things around, why not the colors as well? Um, but I don't know how much I'm digging this. It's kind of strange. Man, this is so much harder than I remember it as being. There we go. All right, now we really have to get moving though. I feel like we're very far away. I don't know how far we are, man. Six kills though! Look at that! What the fuck? I feel like I'm fucking about. I got six kills. Man, I should be playing this more often. <laughs> Mouse and keyboard be like, you'd be you'd be fumbling around. And all of a sudden you're doing you're doing decent. What the fuck? Yo, get fucked on that aim, boy! Bro, what the fuck? It's go. What the fuck? Oh wait, how are they shooting like that? We have a sniper. What the fuck is wrong with these people? What? Bro, what the? That is that. What? That is someone who can aim. Oh man, that just feels wrong. I would have had no problem dying to one of those people that could barely hold their own gun because I can barely hold my own gun either. So I'd be like, hey, you know, it was a 50-50 chance. We we did we did the best we could. It was all right, but no, this is a guy who's out here with just a sniper, just like one shotting people. The fuck are you doing, man? I think that we should leave it at that because apart from that Smurf, I think that we're not gonna get a match that's better than this. Uh, we got seven kills in that match. We got two kills before that, nine kills in total, which is nine more than I ever thought I would get today. So uh, let's end this video on a high note. All in all though, I really, really enjoyed today. Uh, there's things that I'm worried about because my aim is definitely worse than I ever imagined it would be. At the same time, I'm hopeful because uh, right now the lobbies are very forgiving and I can really, really see a progression path forward, which was something which I was really, really missing on control. If you want to see another video, check it out right there. Also, thank you all so much for everyone who's supporting the channel right here. For you, I also have a very special overtime episode. This time, if you didn't see me die enough, if you didn't see me just like completely mesmerized, I got you covered. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask a friend of mine who is like the best player in Apex that I know to like take me to one of his lobbies and then I'm going to see how well I will do. We'll see how that goes. Maybe I'll do a raid. Maybe I'll actually get a kill. I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I'll see you all next time.